All right, fourth family, uh, this is one more video today to show you how to do online giving. Some of you have been asking uh, your elders and deacons and me about how to go about uh, engaging with the online giving, and uh, I just want to show you real simply how to do that. And so uh, first things first, you're going to go to your web browser. Again, on my Mac, it's Safari. Um, on your computer, it might be Internet Explorer, Google Chrome, Firefox. It doesn't matter, whatever your internet browser of choice is, uh, you're going to go to the search bar and type in www.fourthchurch.com and then hit enter. That will bring you to our website. Uh, hopefully you've been to our website recently. If not, this is a good time to look around a little bit. You can see right here towards the bottom of the screen, there's a section called sermons and that sermons is really a section where we have our Sunday worship stuff, but also uh, various blog posts that we've been putting up throughout the week. Uh, so I would encourage you to check that out. Uh, but to give, all you do is go up to the upper right hand corner of the screen and you see a part of the menu that says give. Click on give. When you click on that give, it will bring you to the uh, a website called Tithely. You can see that in the bar up above, T-I-T-H-E dot L-Y. Uh, it's kind of a weird name for a website, but uh, that is the money-giving website that we are personally working with right now. Uh, once, once you're here, uh, it brings you to this splash page, uh, and it is very secure. You don't have to worry about that. Uh, what you simply do is go to the give part, enter the amount of money you want to give. So let's just say $10 to keep it simple. Uh, you can then uh, decide whether you're doing a, a, just a tithe, if you want to give to the Renew campaign, if you're giving to the Mission of the Month, to Guatemala, to a communion offering. Uh, for, this, for the purpose of this video, I'm going to do tithe. Uh, you can actually set it up to, recur, to do recurring giving. So if you want to just have it set up to donate to the church every week so you don't even have to think about it, you can do that. Um, but then otherwise, enter your name. So obviously, Eric Schalk. Um, my email is Pastor Schalk at iCloud.com. Hopefully this doesn't result in some spam. Uh, and then you can select however you want to pay. Uh, you can pay by card, you can pay by bank, or you can use Apple Pay. And then uh, if you're giving by a credit card, you just enter your credit card information here along with your expiration date and the code on the back. Um, you can elect to help cover the fees. There's a little bit of a fee involved in online giving, but nothing major. Uh, and uh, so you can you can either cover the fees or, or not and then at the end you'll click on give and uh, that will submit your donation it will be taken right off the card and uh, go right into the bank account of the church uh, without any hiccups along the way so hopefully this makes it a little bit more clear on how to do the online giving uh, if you have any questions again feel free to email me or call me uh, I'm happy to walk you through it and uh, I hope that uh, you found this helpful in some way.